actually I asked the young man who was selling the louvers and the citron, I said, does this replace Kapuras when they put the chickens around the head? He said, yeah, yeah, for a lot of people who don't want to do that to the chicken, this is the option. But then some people said I was making fun of the tradition. I wasn't making fun of the tradition. I wanted to get rid of all the dark clouds around me, all the people who hate me, who wanted to kill me over the years. And I believe in that. So if Hashem can make my life easier, why wouldn't I be honoring the celebration of the Jews coming out of Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur right into Sukkot and the Simchat Torah? I don't know many Gentiles who even understand that. So somebody, but, so somebody lied to you, said it was the lulav instead of a chicken, or we do something. No, no, they said this is like an alternative. Uh -huh. Instead of having the kapoors with the chicken, you have the lulav. And so, then, so so far they call you an anti-Semite, and yes. now you don't know how to shake a lulav correctly. Right. Is that the best they could throw at you? Right. Meantime, I'm in the community. That where are they? So I've been in Crown Heights the last few nights. I've been in Borough Park. I've been dancing. Last night for Simcha Torah, I was at the Habada 95th Street, and they kept giving me whiskey. Oh boy! Oh, I said, oh, I got to go out and patrol a project. But it was great, great celebration. And tonight, I'm reconnecting with Williamsburg because I haven't seen this in Williamsburg since the lockdown and the pandemic. And that's why I campaign in the streets. I'm not in the houses, I'm in the streets.